this is Sadiq. In today's demo, I am going to show you how to use the encryption uh, secure model in Mule.Mule4. Mule what uh, there is a uh, many changes has been introduced and has the component has been modified in the Mule4 just to have more user friendly and more developer friendly to maintain the components and un un unnecessary uh, multiple to use multiple component to make the process it, it is very easy that one component as are performing multiple operations that it is easy for developer to out to not uh, keep in mind that uh, other other component has to use for uh, one message processing so, so I today I'm going to show you that uh, PGP encryption in Mule 4 version. Uh, here you can go and uh, you can create the Mule project. Uh, P, let me create the Mule project PGP uh, encrypt, encryption. Okay, and you can go and compete for this. I'll go to the HTTP listening to accept the request I'll go to the PGP how you go to the PGP like I'll show you that uh, you have to uh, go to the search in the uh, accents and uh, go to the okay. That uh, in cryptography module, you have to add in in your section module, and you can download, and it will see that uh, all this related the in in crypto uh, secured uh, component will be available here. Okay, so I'll go here first to encrypt because we have to encrypt encrypt, and then uh, I'll go to the VM. I'll go to the publish. Uh, hope you guys know that in they have also in Mule 4.0 the VM components have been changed has been complete and divided in multiple parts that will, is going to consume listener publish that if listener uh, consume is, uh, uh, is in between the components of the ex, uh, consuming the uh, available uh, available contents in the queue listener is the is helping uh, to accept the request uh, as being the source uh, component in the flow publish you can send in the publish and public assume is that is a request response uh, strategy it works here that it send a request to the VM and wait for response so let's go one by one uh, I'll go to the uh, publish here uh, let's go VM publish okay I'm going to use the local VM and uh, Let's go for the HTTP listener. Okay, let's go avoid any confusion. I'll go at okay, at the FM. Then at let's go at PGP encryption right. And let's let's go uh, to use the PGP encryption encryption model in components here what I am using the Cleopatra I have used my 3.0 uh, PGP encryption uh, demo so I am using the same over here as well I, and I have created one certificate hope you know that how to create certificate go over here and select PGP and enter your details and you will create one certificate over here let's go uh, I uh, let's go the import the certificates let me maybe let me create the folder over here uh, certificates let me go over here at cloud certificates set okay. folder Let's go and uh, save the file over here. Uh, I'll go to the first public. Okay. 
Let's go to the public, uh, public key. Auto file, I'll make this video. Let's go to the private site. Dot short dot gpg. Okay. Done. Let's go and configure the uh, the PGP encryption model. Over here, public key. Public key is you have to you have to uh, provide the at location of the public certificates. I have to put the all the main certificates public. Okay, I set over here. Now go to the H value and you can change. change let me change let me select over here then we'll change on the uh, private Now we have to define the keys over here. Let's go the the key ID. You see, we will right click over here. The key ID. You will find the key ID. Okay. Just enter the key. Fingerprint. Either fingerprint or principal. One of them you can print over here. But I am going to I am going to have the uh, the principal over here. As fingerprint is not valid. This one. And the phrases I have entered 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, I am putting this one, I, you can also put on the runtime or encrypted format somewhere. But I am putting here as a for testing purpose only. Encrypt, uh, encrypt. Encrypt. Okay. Let's go over here. Switch and something. Okay, uh, let me create the real publish. Go to the real. Select the team. Okay. Persistence. Okay, and uh, let's go. Okay, then we have to configure over here. Let's find now. Uh, let's go over here. The PCB Okay. Now let me check what I missed over here. Okay, the key, the key ID, it has to be. This one, key ID, okay. In the you get the key ID. Okay, this one. H. Now this is published. Log, go to print. I can print. Encrypted data, PDP. Encrypted PDP. Okay, and here I want to show you one more thing that whatever the encryption is going to happen over, you can assign in any variable. So I am going to assign uh, PGP var, this is the local variable, uh, this is the var variable over here. Now you know that session variable has been removed from the in 4.x in mule, so only the local variable is going to be available for that. Okay, so let's go with that and publish uh, publish uh, the um, let's try once to go over here once pgp okay let's try once and let me see 
uh, the configuration has been done. I have to go and to define here as a post only. Uh, so I will accept every request. Let me that. Okay, let me go this one and run again. Once again. Okay, deploy it. Okay, deploy it properly. Let's go and uh, make. and request and uh, see what going to be print over here okay you see the printed uh, the data has been encrypted and printed over here let's see if the uh, encryption has been complete uh, oh, uh, is correctly so we'll go and ex uh, read this data and in decrypt once again to see that the current the encryption has been done properly okay so let's go to the pgp uh, okay first we have to go to the vm we have to leave we have to uh, read the message from queue so i have, I have to go over here i have to accept vm configuration which i have already configured about that and uh, i have to pgp right i have configured let's go with the pgp pgp Decryption and now let's go with the logs. Okay, let's go over here and accept the decryption payload. Okay, one more thing, let me see uh, the in this is the payload decryption and what I have. I can here you see that I have assigned the all this encrypted value in the in the in the variable okay so i have to send the variable over here in on the, in the network that because the encrypted data has been stored in the variable itself then the where is where's that p okay so encrypted going to go over here let's see uh so this fine let's go over here and what's that one okay time I do not do anything here over here. You see that if most every component have target value. Most of the component have target value, not everyone, but it's uh, because it's helping that avoid uh, any kind of um, uh, referral or uh, avoiding the soft load to manipulate or uh, a message nature that have to use in terms of the uh, in some in terms of the uh, storing your value in somewhere in the flow. Okay, just to use somewhere in, in the flow is else. Let's go with the uh, now decryption has been configured. Let's go and test once again. Uh, here I have to go decrypted uh, value. Okay. Hello, decrypted value. Hello, Kelton. Okay. okay. Let me show you in the debug mode. Uh, over here. I will debug mode. I'll show you that uh, what I am sending and what I am receiving over here and what the element is doing. Okay. Let me show. Okay, 
let's go and click over here you see in the mid debug mode that the payload is hello pattern payload have been modified because we have assigned the value in the variable particular variable you can go over here you can see the the, the variables is that ETP var and the, the value has been assigned over here okay that is encrypted value it's bytes it's all the values are in byte itself okay so let's go and uh, let's see what we are receiving over here see let's go over here no soft see we have received the bytes and this bytes the in your element automatically going to transform as per required uh, component uh, property uh, let's go with the next component you see the hello pattern with me for right so this is a uh, quite uh, quite controllable and uh, uh, very easy uh, new, uh, encryption or secure security modules in new four. So it's very nice. Uh, thanks, guys. This this is one demo in PGP and uh, many other security modules demo I'm going to share for mid four. Thanks.